hello everyone welcome to elora's kitchen and lifestyle today let's check how to make this delicious bread chop or bread pakoda this came out really really well you should definitely try out this recipe let's get started and check out the recipe first in a pan take three teaspoon of oil add half teaspoon of cumin seeds half teaspoon of ginger and half of an onion finely chopped cook for two minutes in high flame add three boiled potatoes Mix it well for two minutes. Add green peas of one half cup. Add salt as per your taste. Turmeric powder one by four teaspoon. Pepper powder half teaspoon. Cumin powder half teaspoon. Chaat masala one by four teaspoon. And coriander powder half teaspoon. Red chilli powder one by four teaspoon. And garam masala half teaspoon. Mix everything well for two minutes. If you have green chilli, you can add that too. For my son, I'm not adding it. Add coriander one by four cup. Now your masala is ready. Keep it aside. Take basin one cup. Add salt as per your taste. Coriander powder one by four teaspoon. Turmeric powder one by four teaspoon. Add water little by little and make it a batter. Make the batter neither too thick nor too thin because the bread will soak the water. So make sure it's um, proper. And now spread the potato masala in one of the bread and then just put the bread on top of it now cut in the middle now in other breads if you want you can also spread some green chutney or some ketchup and then add the potato masala so green chutney has spice so that's the reason i'm not making it for kid but you can make it with green chutney it will be more delicious now cut into half using a pizza cutter it will be very easy to cut it now dip it in the batter and immediately deep fry it in hot oil keep the oil medium hot do not uh, put it completely hot otherwise it will burn and fry it for 2 minutes in each side And once both the sides are done, remove it to your plate. So fry them in batches, fry two at a time and serve it hot with green chutney or ketchup. Just cut it in the middle and enjoy it hot. Do definitely try out this recipe, it came out really really well. Thank you everyone for watching. Have a very nice day.